There you go. And he smells sweet. For sure. I think Owen is, is an incredible imagination. He also knows he's autistic. I knew the word. I didn't know what it meant. I guess he got his diagnosis, I think, about 18 months old. So finding information uh, that could help us with next steps was really catch as catch can. In regard to Owen's interventions, we started early. Well, it was birth to three. I had him go to a pretty rigid um, ABA preschool and learn by modeling the behavior and went on to an ABA-based program after that and also did inclusion as well. Through that, you do see progress, certainly, and it was a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. We have really thought from time to time we were, we were making great progress, and then the next day, Owen would fall back. We honestly felt like we were running up a sand hill. We started to think about how you get uh, your son care organized for when you're not around. I, I felt like Owen needed to see that he could live independently and happily outside of our home. Owen lives in a home and he lives with three other individuals. He's, uh, he comes home uh, during the week. My oldest son, Griffin, is 14 months older than Owen. They have always been really close. Owen, there's been a kaleidoscope of different emotions and, and different experiences, but more than anything, it taught me how to be a man. I grew, grew up communicating with Owen without words, so I had to look into Owen's eyes to understand. The relationship with all of them is pretty close. Ty, our youngest, was a peer but also a, a protector of sorts. You know, you had this little man. Let's go! Let's go! Okay, we're in. I think it's made me, without question, more aware of, uh, of other people and their needs. I've been lucky to be on the board of Autism Speaks because we recognize that there are so many different dimensions presenting a, uh, an advocacy and awareness properly. It's a mission of ours. He's happy now. So he's connected enough to know that he's different, which is both a positive and a negative, right, for him. He adores his family. Spending time with family are the things that are really most important to him. And in some ways, he's the, the, the glue that keeps everybody together.